with a slightly different perspective. Well, that was Mary Eisen talking to me a little earlier on today's programme. Uh, let's uh, get right up to date. With me now in the studio is Issam Ikemawi, who's uh, from BBC Arabic, a correspondent from there. And uh, Issam, what are you hearing? Uh, so far, all we, we hear is uh, uh, information coming from the Israeli side, uh, talking about uh, how the Israelis managed to kill uh, Sunwar in, in Gaza, along with two other uh, people. Uh, but there's no official confirmation, although the news it says it's highly likely that it's him and that uh, his body had been taken to Israel for forensic testing DNA and that kind of stuff. Of course, he'd been in Israeli prison before, so they have all the medical records of him, including his teeth. Some reports talk about that he'd, he's been identified by his teeth. But as I said, this is all uh, media reports, nothing, uh, no confirmation from the Israeli government yet. Has there been anything from Hamas themselves? So far there hasn't been uh, anything from Hamas uh, confirming the death of Sinwar. However, many people in the Gaza Strip and, and outside the Gaza Strip believe that it was only a question of time before the Israelis would you know, get, get Sinwar. Uh, considering that Gaza is a very small place, very crowded place, and the Israelis have free hand all over the place. So uh, it was only a question of time before they catch up with him. And more broadly, where do you think this leaves Hamas now? Um, uh, undoubtedly, it will uh, weaken Hamas. Hamas has been weakened uh, quite a lot since, you know, the, 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 for the last, uh, over the last few months. However, we've seen in Lebanon, following the assassination of uh, Hassan Nasrallah, that uh, uh, the movement, uh, Hezbollah, has been launching rockets uh, on Israel. Uh, they, they have been able to regroup and continue uh, what, what they were doing. And, and in fact, we've seen in, uh, the, the, the rocket launching uh, intensified over the last uh, few weeks. So uh, I don't think uh, Hamas will go away now, but it's, certainly it's much weaker now. Issam, thanks very much. Uh, we will leave it there because we're coming to the end of this half hour. 